So ultrasound is a great tool. It's, uh, it's mobile, it's cheap, it's safe and it's fast. And partly because of that, it's used increasingly in all sorts of different modalities and putting quite a lot of pressures on ultrasound departments. ScanLab is an AI system that links to a standard ultrasound machine and it quality controls fetal ultrasound images. It was developed at the University of Oxford and is based on machine learning algorithms. It's looked at hundreds of thousands of standard ultrasound scans and therefore has learned what a fetal ultrasound scan should look like. So in order to ensure consistency and high quality of scans, the fetal anomaly screening program in the UK requires sonographers to uh, save certain images during an ultrasound examination. And what ScanNav does, it ensures that the sonographers have done that, uh, ensures that the images that have been obtained are of the highest quality. So if you imagine an expert sonographer who may be doing dozens of scans per day, it is a repetitive task, it is tiring, and you know it's not inconceivable that towards the end of the day perhaps a fatigue can set in, and uh, having a system that reminds the sonographer and tells the sonographer, yes, you have uh, got all the images that you need, and yes, those images are of high quality, that's really useful. So when you're training to learn how to do ultrasound, you have theoretical training, you have practical hands-on training, lots of training with simulation technology these days as well. Um, but outside the training environment, you're then kind of left to your own devices. And having, if you like, a peer in the room with you uh, is very useful. Now having a real person in the room with you is nice, but also quite costly. And what this system does is essentially replace that other person and giving the trainee the confidence that this particular image that I've taken is in the right plane and it's got all the quality criteria that I should be looking for. In addition, it can help for auditing purposes. So uh, in order to make sure that uh, as a department we're providing the best care possible, we audit our practice, we make sure that all the images that we should be getting are in fact on the system uh, in order to demonstrate that we're delivering the highest quality care. And the system, uh, by automating that analysis, makes it a lot easier for us to be able to undertake that audit and demonstrate that we're doing a good job. Mm -hmm.